What's up guys, Heroes of Gaming here and welcome back to another Fortnite Creative video. In today's video I'm going to be showing you guys a bunch of props in Fortnite Creative that have special abilities and cool little features that you may not know about. Um, so yeah, I had to go through every single gallery pretty much in the game to find these props and there's probably a lot more that I haven't found. Um, but yeah, let's start off with the first one. This is a slope container gallery. This is a full gallery which you can find throughout the mem menu in creative and what these do is give you a shield so if you stand in this little uh, circle container it gives you shield over time if you stand in front of this fountain it also gives you shield and then if you break these these also give you shield you have seen these in br before so uh, they will be really cool features for you guys in creative i'm sure you guys can come up with something cool for them so anyway, let's get into some of our items. These are all different random items in here. We're going to start off on the right here. You can hear the car gallery um, A. This is a truck. It plays uh, sound and it has a cool hologram on top of an ice cream. So that would be really cool for maps where you just hide the van underneath the map and you can have the ice cream gallery, uh, ice cream hologram. So anyway, Let's move on to the next one. This one I have only just found actually. I didn't know this was even in game. But it's a cool little llama uh, on a fireplace with this cool little tent. This is from the Jungle Temple Prop Gallery. It looks absolutely awesome and I'm glad they've added this in because it can make some for some unique uh, maps. Anyway, moving on to the next one. This is Street Gallery A. This is a fire extinguisher and if you break it, you can actually jump on it throughout the game. So that would be cool for little escape maps. You could have one of those in the middle of the road and they have to break it to escape something. So anyway, let's move on. This is a military gallery and you will find this door. This is very new, very awesome. And it's a huge door if you can if you make it bigger. And you can also change the settings inside of it, which is absolutely awesome. So anyway, let's move on to the next one. This is the shark props. This is a door, as you can see, a small door. Looks really awesome. You can use this in these vents and create your own maps out of that. So now let's move on to the next one. Dark Tilted Props. This has a green um, kind of effect coming out of it. You can place this underneath maps and create these cool little uh, holes in the ground as if like the, the thing is leaking with the emote. So that's awesome. Anyway, let's head over to the next prefab. This is Other House Prefab. You will find this in the list of houses and it's a doorbell. And all you do is ring the doorbell and it makes a cool sound, as you can hear there. Uh, so that's a pretty cool little item that you may not have found throughout the game. Anyway, let's move on to the next one, Neon Tilted Props. This one is a basketball net not many people know about. If, you, if I show you over here real quick, uh, let me just pick that up and then place it over here. As you can see, it has a cool little outline of a basketball net. And then obviously the net itself um, pretty much is looks really awesome. Uh, so yeah, you've also got this one here. What I have to do for this one is to go into the settings real quick. Change it to really dark. Uh, that's not dark enough. Let me do that again real quick. Uh, there we go. 11pm. And as you can see, this light moves around in the sky. Creating a really cool Batman kind of lighting effect. It looks absolutely awesome. Uh, so yeah, that's another little prop you may not know about. Uh, moving on to the spooky prop gallery, as you can see here, we have a fog machine. This turns fog on and off, as you can see over here. It goes on and off and it looks really cool, creates a nice effect for any horror maps. Anyway, those are some unique props just there. Moving on to the sound sound props, you can find this in the power plant um, props gallery. All these make different sounds. If you go up to this, this makes quite a loud noise. Go up to this, this makes an electricity noise uh, at the back of it, as you can see there. And then you move to this one and it makes an engine noise. It sounds really awesome. And it also moves, so it's pretty cool as well. So you can use those effects inside your game at some point. Anyway, let's move over to the bouncy props that you may not know about. So these are a bunch of props you can actually bounce on inside your game, creating cool parkour or hidden... Uh, like things in your wall that make you bounce, stuff like that. So the anyway, first one, you got the Paradise Palms props. This is a um, swimming pool 
uh, bouncy thing, so you can put one of those like, next. I don't know what you call them, but you can put one of those uh, outside of your swimming pool and bounce on it. Uh, here we have the pirate ship one. Uh, you can bounce on this. It's not much of an effect, but it's pretty cool. You could probably make something cool out of that. Moving on to the next one. Here we have the military props. Um, you can find this one in the military props, but you can find these tires in almost any prefab. But yeah, you can bounce on these. And then these ones you cannot. So that creates quite a cool effect uh, to use different things inside your games. So anyway, moving on, we have the slurp prop, uh, sw slurp, swamp props. This launches you really quite far across uh, maps. So you could probably use that in a swamp. And uh, I've been launched off the map. Let's just get back up real quick. You can use that in a swamp for people to traverse across it really quickly if you really want to. Or you can use it in any other method of your choosing. Anyway, we have the Yacht Gallery Umbrellas. All these you can jump on. There's some umbrellas in game that you cannot jump on. But these ones you can. So that also creates quite a cool effect if you're making like a beach summary um, map. So anyway, moving on to another little feature that you may not know about. I've seen these in previous hubs and... Uh, other game modes uh, but yeah the this is the only stairway you can pretty much walk vertical on it's really awesome uh, as you can see these are the normal steps and then I will show you the difference in a second but you can find this in the art deco gallery so this is like the normal step how you should walk up it this is how you shouldn't walk up it but it still works as you can see it works really fast looks really awesome and um, yeah, you can use this in quite a lot of maps to create some quick stairway. I'm just going to show you the difference real quick. So as you can see, that is pretty much the same height and you cannot walk up this step. But weirdly, you can walk up this one. So yeah, you can use that in quite a few new unique maps. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to see what you do with these guys. Uh, let me know if you've got any other props in the comments section that I have missed with unique sounds oh this is actually one that i've missed here let me just show you that real quick uh this is a tanker you can find in the military prop gallery there's two versions of this one of them does not blow up and this one if you hit it it creates an explosion i believe it doesn't damage you in game but it's still a really cool unique prop uh that you may not know about you can also have it to create the fire effect as well anyway guys i do hope this video helped you don't forget to hit that like button if it did. Don't forget to subscribe for more as well. Hit that bell if you get notified. Uh, so you get notified in the future when I'm creating more tutorials. Anyway, don't ask about my character. It's absolutely glitched out as soon as I loaded into this game. I don't know why, but I'm guessing I'm going to get a few comments on that. I've just realised I actually forgot, to be honest, to mention that at the start of the video. Anyway, guys, I do hope you enjoyed this one. Um, if there's anything else that I've missed, make sure to comment them down below. Uh, subscribe for more, click that bell so you get notified when I upload in the future. I do tutorials on the hubs every single week and I'm going to be doing a lot more unique tutorials coming very, very soon. Anyway guys, I will see you all in the next one.